Hey guys, me host Super Zero. Thank you very much for tuning in. So we're going on the toy hunt. Today we're going to go to Sheffield. We're going to go to to, to Meadow Hall, and we're also going to go to Smiths. Please, please. We see what we can find at the Disney store. There has been lots of sightings of brand new toy box, and there's been sightings of some new Galaxy's Edge stuff leaking into Disney Store UK. So we're going on a toy hunt to see what we can find today. Tune in tomorrow for the haul because I've got a haul of goodies, not from today, but. Stuff that's already here. <laughs> that's a lot of stuff. Yep. So tune in tomorrow for my big haul. Today's video is just going to be the toy hunt video, um, and then tomorrow you'll see the big haul. So tune in then. But stick around for today's video as we've got some awesome footage. So let's roll the toy footage. All right, guys. So we are hunting toys today. Here we are in Meadow Hall. Superstar Junior is ready to go. We found the new Venomized Green Goblin. That's a special edition pop here in Disney Store. Uh, they wanted $14.99 for this pop, which isn't that bad. It's quite nice. Number 597 in the Venomized collection. And you don't see Venomized version of Green Goblin very often. So that's pretty cool. They also had these really cool new remix Pixar figures in. They had Buzz and Woody. So I was very tempted to get both the aliens dressed up. But these are $8.99, which I think is pretty scandalous for what it is, to be honest. Tifa! So I really love this. Um, it was £34, I think it was. But it looks so cool. So tempted. And we'll see that again in just a few moments in better detail. Um, I moved on and had a look at the Toy Story stuff as I obviously these little green eye men remind me of my childhood. I love them so much. I really want a bag of these and they're only like a tenner or something so I really want one eventually. And of course they've got the Mr and Mrs Potato Head and many other things including the Pizza Planet pullback car. I really want that one. It looks so cool. I really want that on my desk so I'm very tempted by it. If I get nothing else in the near future, I will be picking that bad boy up on the Disney Star website. I know. Have you seen how much it is? How much is it? 35. How much? 35. Right. What are you wanting? I don't know. Is that the same doll that I was looking at? You know what's sweet? The little dolls. Yeah. That doll is 8 dollars 95 on her own. How many is on the shelf? One. Oh. You're going to Harry Potter in a week though, you're not going to prefer Harry Potter? It's so cool! And apparently there's some mystery figures in behind all of that as well. There is some stuff further back that you can't really see very well. So this, little figures. Yes, yeah, so this is the playset. It's a brand new teapot playset for Fortin Capel, part of the Disney Fairy Range. They seem to be upping the, the Disney Fairy Range again recently, I've noticed. They've, they've got some new minifigures in stock. Like, you can find this this little Tinkerbell in a minifigure on her own, along with... Who are the other two fairies they've done with it? There's Silver Mist and... Fawn. Ah, okay. So, yeah, you can pick up some of the others as well to go with this. It is a very nice set for the price, actually. And this set is... What, just short of 36 the doll itself is already eight pounds so you're probably better off getting the set and we moved on to lego star lego star had a green and red system in place where if it was red outside the store you couldn't go in so we stood a few moments just outside enjoying this new mario stuff and the brand new iron man picture uh, frame that you can now buy and we went in store and had a look at some of the awesome display pieces i always like looking at these so these are the new toy story stuff very nice indeed i really like them and then, of course, they've got all the brand new Mario stuff on display. Super Soul Junior was going mental trying to get all these. She wants them so bad, but I think she's a little bit young just now. What do you guys think? Let us know. <clears throat> I do like how they've made it all float in the air and stuff. It just it looks very flimsy to me. And, of course, they had the new Wonder Woman 1984 set. Brand new by DC Collectibles. Uh, sorry, DC Lego. <laughs> DC Collectibles are gone. <laughs> And they've got, of course, all the other older sets as well. I haven't seen many new sets, to be honest, but I do like some of these Harry Potter ones. That's my chair reversing and beeping <laughs> in the background. And, of course, you can get Pivot Drive, which does include Dobby, which I kind of like, although Dobby is as tall as the other characters, which is weird. <laughs> and, of course, then they've got the Weasley's house as well that includes Bellatrix Lestrange. They were so expensive, but they look awesome. Yeah, I'd really like them. But some of the smaller sets of Harry Potter, like the bus we've already picked up, and I would like to get the Patronus set. That would be a very cool set to have on display, especially if you lit up the actual Patronus with an LED light. It makes some great photography with that. Then they had some of the more set sets for adult kids, including Friends and other things. It's kind of cool. I like it, I suppose. 
Meh. Can give that a hard skip, though. Well, we did have the Big Bang Theory <clears throat> We did do the Big Bang Theory one, yeah, years ago. I really want that Mickey Mini, though. They're so expensive, but they look awesome together. I still would like the Steamboat Mickey set. I just can't find it anywhere now, and I regret not getting it. What you got? Spring rolls. Spring rolls. like spring rolls. <laughs> you have a bite of this on camera for me? You have a bite of chicken? <laughs> what do you think? Is that good? Yeah. I got yakitori. Mmm. -hmm. Okay. And back on the hunt we go, and now we're gonna go to the store under the stairs, is it called? Something like that? Covered under the stairs. Covered under the stairs, that's the one. It's the Harry Potter store. Chocolate frog time. Chocolate frog time. And I definitely want one of those two ones. Um, either, what's she called? Lestrange? Letter. Letter Lestrange. Or Dumbledore's one before he got the Elder Wand as a part of the Fantastic Beast series. <laughs> There's a <laughs> Ragog. Oh, Lenny. 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 Creature. Creature. I haven't seen a creature bush. Oh. Creature loves to serve the House of Black. <laughs> <laughs> I like You've creature. got only toy spiders up here. What? Toy spiders. Oh. I'm only going to just back as well. It's like Get it, every flavoured jelly beans. Jelly beans. Mint. Green apple jelly beans. Not mints. Green apple jelly beans. Ooh. Mm. Taste not touch, darling. Ah. Told you, crumb rolls. We have a chocolate froggy page? Can we get one from. Oh, what? That's fine. Sorry, mate. You get me a chocolate frog, Winnie. Yeah, I want a chocolate froggy. Them, no, you don't have them. You'll get your teeth. And here we are, um, Avalon Toys, and they have pretty much the same stuff since before lockdown. Uh, they have got the masks masking now. But <laughs> yeah, I don't know why you'd ever want it though, to be honest, other than a display piece. You couldn't wear it because it turned into the mask. That wooden thing changes, so. I don't see the point in using it for cosplay or anything like that, unless you were going to dress up as Jim Carrey. But, anyhow. Um, I, would, I went backwards on another look, because I do fancy that Scream Living Dead doll. That could be something I may get in the near future. But they, I was actually looking to see if they had It Chapter 2 stuff, and they didn't. Hey, look, it's Galaxy Quest. You don't see that very often. Never give in. Never surrender. Pretty sure that's the line. I may have butchered that completely, and I'm sorry. Paige, what you found? I found this. Who's that? I don't know. Is it Daddy? Yeah. <laughs> I got shot in my arm. Oh. <laughs> yep, she found the Pokemon stuff pretty quickly as soon as we went into Smith's. Um, she ran for the Pokemon stuff, but we are going to have a look because they do also have the new Funko Battle World stuff in stock now, which is the new Marvel game that you can play. They have got the starter set in stock for $16.99, and the Battle World bottles are seven, uh, sorry $6.99 each. Um, so they are a little bit more on the expensive side. They're not cheap, but they are Funko. Each of these little balls contain two figures. One of them is a mystery figure, and then you get lots of other things you can see there. Look including cards and all sorts. So if you're going to play the game, these are definitely worth it. I don't think these are going to be worth it just as collectibles, so I kind of skipped and I didn't bother grabbing them. I would normally have bought them, but as it's more of a game, I don't think anyone's going to play it with me in my house, so I skipped. But they did have the really cute baby Yoda in his sideways box again, because he's big ears, and he's got the force-wielding one. And the Fortnite stuff's pretty much the same as it was last time I was here. Uh, no new McFarland's ones. 
But I was also looking for the SummerSlam version of The Fiend from WWE, but I can't find that either. Anyway, let's go back to the main cam. So guys, what were your thoughts on our toy hunt and all today? What did you think? We had fun. Those chocolate frogs were nice. Yeah, they were really tasty. Chocolate they had, like, frog popping, like popping candy inside. Mm. And I, like the cards were really fun. <laughs> Superstore Junior really enjoyed collecting them cards as well. Yeah. Which means I'm going to have to spend a fortune because she wants some more. And that Tinkerbell playset. Oh, I do want that playset. <laughs> Yeah, and uh, we saw Luna Lovegood today, the Harry Potter doll, but we didn't bother picking her up. We're going to wait for Voldemort. He's out next week. He'll be coming to us on Wednesday. So yes. not long for Voldemort now. Yeah, we're overly keen on Luna. She looked a bit odd. <laughs> and we we had some nice sushi, as you saw. I had some sushi. Soupsaw Junior had some yakitori chicken. And some noodles. And some noodles. So we had a good day out. But guys, what were your thoughts on our day today? Do you enjoy this toy hunt? Let me know in the comments down below. Are you excited for the toy haul? Let me know about that also in the comments down below. But guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, I'm your host, Super Soul, and I'll see you tomorrow Bye. in the toy haul.